Some feel that President Obama struck out at the All-Star Game recently with his choice of jeans, according to some fashion experts. So we've invited Adam Rappaport, style editor of GQ magazine, to show us how every man can get his denim wardrobe just right. Adam, good morning to you. Good morning, Jeff. Good to be here. Um, listen, <laughs> this did get a lot of attention. The yes. president at the All-Star Game wearing these big baggy jeans. Tell Billowy me what was, a little. What was perhaps. wrong with them? You know, they, they weren't terrible. They were fine. I think part of the problem is Obama has kind of set the bar very high for himself. You see him very stylish in the suits, in the undone shirts. Oh, These yeah. jeans were just a little loose. They were, they were dad jeans. Just because yes. you're a dad doesn't mean you need to wear dad jeans. And he defended them right after. He said. Yeah, you know, he said, listen, I'm not the guy who's going to wear tight jeans. If you think I'm that guy, you got the wrong guy. Which is, I don't need to see my president in skinny jeans, but let's just slim them down a little bit, a little darker, not so, you know, Suburban dad. Right. Speaking of, we, we have some pictures now of other presidents in jeans over the years, and different presidents handled them in different ways, whether it's President Clinton right here with kind of the lighter yeah, stonewash Yeah, the bad kind look. of stonewash, a little too snug in certain areas. I don't need to see that either. Okay. And uh, President Bush with... with W, w did it well jeans. up on the ranch in Texas. He actually looks like he kind of, he, he looked more comfortable in jeans than he ever did in a suit. And the cowboy boots are cool, Yes, obviously. exactly. And President Reagan. And Reagan, of course, classic, uh, straight off, you know, the Hollywood set. Okay, so three rules, and uh, President Carter as well, posing by the tree with a nice belt buckle. All right. Presidents through the years in jeans. Three rules when right, it comes quickly. to jeans for men. Yes. One, no more bootcut jeans. We're done with those. Okay. Straight leg. Two, dark denim. We don't need like the overly faded, stonewashed, all that nonsense. And three, especially if you're Obama's age, we don't need those low ride jeans. You know, <laughs> we don't need to see your underwear. We don't need to see anything else. They should ride in your hips, but not up high in your waist. Okay. We have a number of models here this morning. Uh, for different scenarios. Yes. I, I, if you're going out in jeans, the first one, this is for... All right, Dylan, this is if you, can, if you work in an office where you can wear jeans, um, keep them dark, keep them simple, keep them straight. None of these fake whiskers or anything. These are by APC, a French company. These jeans we love. They're as simple and classic as you can get. Uh, nice jacket and tie. Um, there's no reason you can't wear this to work, out at night, anything. Office casual on a Friday, for exactly. example. Exactly. Okay. Uh, up next, um, let's take a look at if you're heading out. Going out at night. Uh, we got Ryan. Listen, if you're, if you're a young strapping lad like Ryan, maybe you want your jeans a little slimmer, a little tighter. Simple great dark shirt. This is by DKNY. Safari shirt marked by Marc Jacobs jeans. Dark, slim, straight, simple. And he's got Done. the loafers. He's got and loafers, no, no, no socks. Because it's summertime. Yes, key. All exactly. right. Exactly. Right, very very nice. cool, very easy. Thank and, you. Hey, and you don't need a belt when you're wearing jeans. Oh, really? If they fit. Is that, is that a new rule or an old rule? That's a, that's an eternal rule. If they fit, oh. what do you need a belt for? Okay, shows how much I know about fashion. Hey, yeah, come on, Jack. You got to get with it. <laughs> thank Talk thank to your wife. She'll tell you. <laughs> yes, she probably will. Immediately after this segment, uh, let's move to weekend jeans. All right, a little more cash. Listen, this is these are essentially very similar to what Obama was wearing. These were by Martin and Osa, uh, but like I said, they're just a little straighter. They're not pulled up so high. They're not as billowy, and also no running shoes with jeans. You're not unless you're Jerry right. Seinfeld. No running shoes with jeans. Stick real, to real sneakers. Simple white canvas sneakers in the summertime. Maybe you go leather in the winter. Uh, keep the jeans simple. Keep the sneakers simple. Socks, no socks. I don't know. You got socks on there, Mitch? Yep. Oh, he does. Oh, Mitch he's, a, he's a sock guy. He's a sock too, guy. Like yes. the charcoal socks. Matches his hair. All right, <laughs> Mitch. Thank you very thank much. You, um, you say no running shoes with jeans, but yes. here we have some some top some, some dock siders, top Docks, siders. Yeah. Well, it's summertime once again. We have the white jeans for that jeans. sort of beachy summery look. Break them out in the summer. These are the exact same jeans I'm wearing by Levi's Capital E line. Uh, they're simple. They're, the, the cut is still the same. They're just white. You know, have a little fun in the summertime. Loosen up a little. They're slim fitting. The, well, he's a slim guy. You know, like I said, you just keep. You don't have to have tight jeans, but keep them straight. That's that's the thing. Buy a pair of jeans you're comfortable with. Are you a white jean advocate? I actually have. I was wearing these exact pair yesterday, as was our fashion editor Damian News was wearing the exact pair yesterday. All right. Yeah, we like them at GQ. And finally, socks, no socks. We've got, we've He's got probably going no socks. socks. You're at the beach. The, uh, you don't need socks at the beach. Or the Sperry's or whatever else. All right, Adam Rappaport, some good stuff here. Thank you, Jeff.